Damn it. That was the last bottle of wine. For fuck's sake. Ever since those dwarves ran off. It was the last bottle of wine and I'm hungry. I could just fucking fly. I could go get my own food. I can't fucking fly. Hmm. I wonder if I could use some magic to summon minions to bring me food. I could probably do that. Oh, I'm so fucking hungry. I just want a um, slab of meat, like some tri tip that's been it's nice and rare, but is also to the point where the fat peels off and is all tender. And I want fucking strawberry cheesecake and more wine. And I want beer and bread and I want some of that fucking soup. That one adventurer ended up bringing them when they were foolish enough to come in here. Ugh! I fucking hate this. I have no minions to do my bidding. This fucking sucks. <sighs> Maybe I should find somewhere else to live. Somewhere where I can hire minions. But if I leave this place and I lose all my treasure... Ugh, I hate these fucking decisions. It pisses me off. Well, no. That's new. Hmm. Seems like one of those lowly dwarves didn't run away. Well, you certainly took your sweet ass to- What the fuck is this? You're not a dwarf, you're a human. And a really scrawny human at that. He wouldn't be able to fill me up. <sighs> this is what I get for wishful thinking, I suppose. Mm. <sighs> well... I guess you do make, you will make things entertaining when I go to sl to kill you. Well, yeah, I can't exactly slap the shit out of you if my tail is under my skirts now, can I? Now hold still. <laughs> You're fast, I'll give you that. Still, hold fucking still. <sighs> this is what I hate about human adventurers. Always wiggling your way into another dragon's territory wanting to take her fucking treasure. Pisses me off, among other things. What? Who am I? Who am I? Ugh, hold still, you little fucker! Don't you know who I am? Surely they talk about me. The ever-burning... God, I can't remember my other titles, but still! Don't they fucking talk about me in Legends, you little... Ugh, stop squirming so I can fucking slap you with my tail. Ugh, you ignorant little fucker. Fine. I suppose I have to educate you as well as kill you. I'm Themberchard. You seriously never heard any legends about me. Well, that explains why you're so ignorant. 
Mm. <laughs> oh, you know what? At this point, I just might... I just probably ought to try sitting on you. At least then that will kill you. Because... Uh, I may be fat, but at least my heaviness has some uses. So... If you won't submit to being slapped into oblivion with my tail, then I'll just have to fucking sit on you. Well, of course I have to do this. <clears throat> Did I squish you? What the hell? My ass is huge. How could I fucking miss something as tiny as you with this fat ass? <sighs> Well, I have to do something to keep you adventurers from stealing my treasure. I can already tell you want to just fucking load your backpack with my treasure and then make like a thief and run for it. Ugh. It is too early for this. I'm too fucking hungry for this. You're not after my treasure. Oh, this bottle still has some wine in it. Ugh. Ugh, why it makes things a little better. But if you're not here for my treasure, then what the fuck are you doing here? Are you here to kill me? Good luck with that, by the way. A lot of adventures have tried and they've all failed. Either I've squashed them or I've eaten them. Mm-hmm. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh, you mean saying the word. It makes me hungry. I'm so fucking hungry. Uh, and of course, the fact that you're here and you're too scrawny for me to eat, that's like insult injury. I'm hungry for everything. Look at me. Do I look like I'm a, sm a, tiny, a, a delicate eater? I eat anything and everything that comes into my lair. <laughs> Have I eaten another dragon? No, that's gross. And cannibalism. Besides, even if I were to indulge in the practice of cannibalism, the dragon in question would have to be well-fed and well-bred for me to even consider gracing them with my palate. I eat a lot, but I do have a discerning palate. I'm so fucking hungry. You can cook? What kind of things can you cook? Well, you're freakishly prepared for a situation like this. Were you planning on running into me and begging for your life by offering me food instead. You also seem weirdly excited about being here. That's weird. You're weird. Ugh. But honestly, I'm too hungry to fucking complain. So, cook me up something good and it better look as good as it smells and taste as good as it looks and smells because if you try and feed me garbage I will kill you in the m most horrific way possible and then I will use magic to make you more palatable and I'll eat you if you're unable to satisfy me I'm just giving you a friendly warning is all now chop chop make with the cooking I'm hungry and wine can only fill me up for so long. Not to mention there's only so much wine left in this bottle, so I'd hurry up if I were you. Human. So this is what you made me. What is it? Rioli's in thick sauce, eh? Hmm. Give me that. Hmm. It smells good. And I suppose it does look appetizing from a certain angle. Ah. <sighs> Don't mind the creaking. 
like, the floor of, of this cavern creaks every time I make a certain step because, you know. And stay still. A little bit of wine. And let's see. Hmm. 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 Well, it's not making me sick. And it is warm. Paired with wine. Mm. Mm. This shit's actually really good. You can live for now. Mm. Make one more comment about my tiny wings. See what happens. I got you this time. I know I didn't kill you, but that should hurt. And I hope it does, since I'm slapping you rather hard. Mm. Well, if you have to know, my wings are small because I can't fly. And I can't fly because, well, you're not blind. You know why. Ugh. Things have been different ever since that uh, new creed was posted or whatever. Well, I mean, I think it was. It could have been a bill or something, but whatever. Either way, it means... All the people who used to live here left, and I'm the only one taking up space now, you know, to keep all my treasure to myself. Yeah, there used to be gray dwarves running around here. I kept their forges lit and nice and hot so they could do their metalworking and stuff. And in return, they fed me and they pampered me as I ought to be because I'm a fucking red dragon. And... Obviously, I'm very important. And, well, you know, I also gave them the incentive that they that if they didn't compensate me in some way or form for keeping their forges lit, that I'd just start fucking eating off the weak ones. The ones that couldn't get away from me. They listened, and, well, we had a decent enough agreement, but now they're gone, and I'm the only one here, and this is honestly really the first good meal I've had in ages, so. And so, yeah, you can live, but don't get too comfortable. So, why are you here if you aren't interested in killing me or stealing my treasure. Come on, you can tell me. I won't judge you. I'll only judge you a little bit. Well, I'll only judge you a little bit. Depending on what your answer is. Come on. Spit it out, human, before I make you spit it out. So, you're here because you wanted to see me, despite the fact that you haven't really heard of me in legend? Well, I hope it's everything you dreamed it would be, and what's this? Dessert? You make candy too? Hmm. 
from a marketplace, eh? Hmm. Mm. 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 It has sweetness and chewy. Kind of like a dwarf, but better. And oh, mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Mm. I taste fucking strawberries, and I love strawberries. Have you got any more of these? What are they called? Sotnems? Mm -hmm. Give me that. Okay. You can live, however. You have to stay here, and you have to be my minion. I'll pay you one silver piece for every meal you give me. Okay, fine. One gold piece every for every meal you make me. You don't want my money? Have you not seen how big this treasure hoard is? I'm pretty sure I could give you something from here that would make you, like, stupid rich. Like, in, in, like, beyond words, wealthy. Well, then what do you want? You want an... What? Are you a bard? Yeah, answer my fucking question, human. Are like I know you're an adventurer, but are you a fucking bard? Only bards are into freaky shit like that. And trust me, I've had so many bards come here and try and hit me up. Oh, I ate all of them. Yeah. Mm, I truly don't think there is anyone in the entire world who can handle all of this. Especially this fat ass, these massive tits, and this fat, bulging stomach. Not to mention my fat ass tail. <laughs> oh really, you think you could handle me, human? Hmm. Well, I suppose you can try and prove yourself. Okay, I'll let you take whatever amount of gold you need and when you need to restock on things for cooking. But it's not just food, you know. I expect baths to be drawn from me. There's a hot springs nearby. You'll have to buy me things from the outside because I can't really get out. The entrances are too small. And also, I can't really fly. I can only hop around with these stupid, flimsy little wings stuck to my back. So you're going to have to run me baths, cook for me, buy me things, and make sure I'm well fed. I... The gray dwarves that used to live here spoiled me rotten and pampered me in exchange for keeping their porches lit, and I'm not about to quit that fucking lifestyle any time soon, so you better be able to fucking pamper me and take care of me, because I'm worth it. After all, I am a red dragon. And, again, I'm, I'm important, and I'm worth it, and you're going to have to just deal with me bossing you around, because... You're my minion. I plan on getting more minions so that way you have helpers, quote unquote. But when that happens, you'll be the head minion. But until now, you are just one minion. <clears throat> Ugh, my claws look really dull. How about. Mm. That st 
pasta soup thing was really good, by the way. Ah. Uh, finish it off with some wine. Ah. Uh, and another one of these sotnems for another dessert. And here's the thing, you better be able to fucking bake because I love cakes and sweets and I've, oh, now I really want some strawberry cheesecake. So can you deliver? Alright, fine. You're hired, human. Don't get used to these head pads. Oh, excuse me. You only get treats and praises when you've done really good. Now, before you get on to making me some strawberry cheesecake, I want my claws buffed and polished. Well, go on. Chop, chop, human. 